What's up everybody? It's Jackie and today I'm playing BitLife. So my cousin recently got me into this game and he said my cousin Matt actually and he suggested that I start playing it and unlocking ribbons or achievements. So what I'm planning to do today is trying to get the addict ribbon as well as the high roller ribbon. So I'm going to hit new random life. Surrender Chloe Ward, yes. I thought I could do custom, but okay. I guess I'm just gonna have to stick with Jamar Morris. I was born a male in Montego Bay, Jamaica. I was conceived in the back row of a movie theater. My birthday is November 29th. I am a Sagittarius. Okay, my father is Devon Morris, a mortician, and my mother is Abigail. I'm I'm totally butchering these Jamaican names, I'm so sorry. I have an older brother named Benton. Family cat named Juno, aw. Oh, so smarts and looks, he's really, really low. Okay, that would be good for another achievement, but let's see if I could do the gambling one since that's what I was planning on doing. So let's age him up. My mother and my father had a baby boy named Henry, my new brother. He was conceived on a Caribbean cruise. They have really interesting places where they conceive children, I'll tell you that much. All right, so we don't really, we can't be a three-year-old addict, so let's keep going. These, these ribbons have nothing to do with family relationships. Oh my God, Ziggy, that's such a cute name. He was conceived while my parents were visiting the Alamo. Oh my God. <laughs> All right. <coughs> Dead chipmunk on your pillow. What do you do? Yell at her, do nothing. Um, this doesn't need to do with pets, so let's train her not to do that. Awesome. You can start getting addicted when you're older, so let me speed this up, actually. Pneumonia. Okay, so let's go to the doctor. Dr. Lorexia Allen has determined you are currently suffering from pneumonia. You are no longer suffering. Okay, cool. I'm cured. Awesome. Oh, your cat's in the head. Juno's trying to climb up and get my attention. Oh, that's cute though. I'm gonna reward her for that. With some cheese. Awesome. So I have a good relationship with my cat. That's probably the only person I'm gonna have left <laughs> to become a gambler. Yeah, I'm gonna go toward gambling. And if, if I am offered a drink or drugs, I will take it since... I looked on Game Zebo for some hints on how to get ribbons, and that's when it said to just keep accepting. Like, hey, you want you want heroin? Like, just like just take it. You broke. Oh my! You broke your parents' sex toy while you were trying to understand what it was. Uh, that's an awkward conversation. Wasn't me. She got me in the shower, wasn't me. Saw the marks on my shoulder, wasn't me. Heard the words that I told her, wasn't me. <laughs> I broke my parents' sex toy and lied about it. Okay. My little brother Ziggy started elementary school. I started secondary school. Uh, nothing to do with academics. Let's just keep going. Dead chipmunk. No, just, you know, just don't do that. Like, leave the chipmunks alone. You're slowly killing off the population. Don't, don't do that. Okay, great. Let me see if I could start. I, I'm probably only gonna start gambling at. I think 18 is the the beginning when you could start gambling. So I'll skip to 18. Benton graduated from high school. Uh, oh, okay. I'm just going to... They said for a high roller that you have to stake a lot of money to win big. I should have... Oh, I should have been building my parents' relationship so they could offer to pay for university. Alright. So let me go to university so I could start taking some classes and then get a job where I get big money. Pick a major. Mm, I think political science I'm going to make a lot of... I mean, no, no, political silence. Mm. 
Political science, you could get... Hmm, maybe, maybe music? I feel like with political science, for some reason, if I... If it, it's found out that I'm a gambler, that won't look good in my career, I may, I may get fired. That could probably go for all of them, but I'm just gonna do music. Rejected? Oh yeah, because I didn't keep my academics up. Damn. So now we can start gambling. How much money do I have? I have $71,960. Oh yes. Okay, so we can start gambling. Sweet. Okay. Let's go to the casino and let us start gambling. Barrington, let's start at the family casino. Let's 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 start out small, shall we? Ten thousand dollars off the bat. No, let's play conservatively. Let's go in the middle, just because I feel like our first time we're not going to be that good. So this is okay. Twenty-one. What do I have? Thirteen. Oh, that's not that's not looking good. All right, let's give it a shot. Because I think if I hit, I'll stand. Then I won't. Get anything out of it. Hit me. Hit me. Bust. Oh, damn it. What's happening if we do 10,000 off the bat? Yes. So what does it say for addict? It says, avoid carrying drug or damning event. Rack up as many addictions as you can. No. Must take a lot of money to win big. Okay. So let me... Let me bet. Oh, wow. It automatically goes to 25. Let me take a little break. Let's go to... The nightclub and see if I'm offered any drinks. The cadence. Bouncer won't let you into the club. <laughs> That's so sad. I'm sorry, Jamar. So it came out 5,000 ahead after a session of blackjack at Family Casino. So we're at 26% happiness, smart 17%, and looks 4%. Alright. Age, my little brother. I've been given a raise. Awesome. Let me go to the bank. Actually, no. Let me go to the casino now. I hit 92,000. Visit the casino. Barrington's. I'm going to stake 25,000. Deal them. 16, not bad. Hit me. Oh! Okay, again. Again. Again, we're supposed to be gamblers. 10,000, why not? Oh, that is so, that is so close to 21. I'm going to stand. Oh, son of a gun. Really? Right at 21? Lataria, you are good, girl. You're good. Another 10,000. At 10, hit me. 19, I'll stand. No! <laughs> no! One point off! Oh my goodness. That is too crazy. Alright, let's get it a break. You are now addicted to gambling. Awesome! Okay. So I think in order to get the achievement, right, the person needs to die. So let's at least start dating. Happiness is zero. High roller. She, Jamar has to live for a little bit, like a little bit longer in order to get high roller. So let's make him happy. Let's go to the gym. Work on self-improvement at the gym. For two to just what I was thinking. I was like, at least let him date. While at the library, you met a female named Virtudes Edwards. Age 16. How old are we? 
Age 19, okay. It's not terrible. <laughs> Illegal still, but not terrible. Ask her on a date. Oh my gosh, no! I didn't think this, I forgot how realistic this game is. You have been charged with dating a minor and are facing two years in prison. Who's the more expensive one? We have enough money to spend. Stuart and Scott, not guilty. Son of a gun. That's crazy, all right. Find someone to love. One night stand's gonna get us crabs. So let's, let's just find a date. Smarts and money. Latoria, the dealer. All right, let's, let's ask her on a date. Latoria has rejected you. She called you a dingbat. <laughs> That's so sad. Jamar just can't catch a break. Okay, age. You've been diagnosed with depression. No. Let's go. Let's try to find love again then. Dating app. Pick your desired income. They're not going to be happy though if you're... It's said that the partner's gonna, not going to be happy if you spend a lot of money gambling. So let's just find a date. Looks smart. So let's just ask her on a date. 23 years old, Zakia. Petty officer, second class in the Navy. Going steady, great. A little bit better with happiness. And then let's go to age up. A raise, great. Okay, so our girlfriend's happy. We're getting a little bit happier. Let's gamble now to just totally wreck that. And hopefully Zakia doesn't totally get mad at us because we're not married. So it's not like we're spending her money. Yeah, so it's most likely that she won't get mad. Casino, not crime. No, casino. Barrington. You've lost $40,000 at the casino during your life. Place your blackjack bets. 10,000. I'll stand. <gasps> you tied. Hit me. I'll stand. I won. All right, back to the casino. Leave the casino. Family casino. Pick your bets. We are going for 25,000. Oh, I just realized I can gamble at the horse races too. I'll do that next. Kaimani's the dealer. I'm at 16. Hit me. S 25,000 again, no. 10,000 again, deal them. Hit me. Hit me. Uh. Argument. Your girlfriend Zeke Zakia is arguing with you because you lost money at the casino. Uh, let's apologize to her to keep our happiness up. Happiness is at zero. Oh boy. Horse races. Maybe we'll get happier if we uh, gamble on the horses and hopefully win. 10,000. I'm pretty sure I'm gonna get the Addict Ribbon if I'm looking at how I'm playing now. High Roller is a pretty hard ribbon. 10,000, place your horse, fast cash. Start the race. Fast cash, let's go. Let's go fast cash. Fast cash, yes, no! The horse races are hard. There's a little bit more strategy in the card game. With the horse race, it's all chance. Age. Movie theater, take her. Take her to the theater to be happier. Proposal, ask you to marry. You have been together for four years. What will you do? Oh, if we're married? We're going to be getting into a lot of arguments. Yeah, 
But, but we have, no, we don't have her income coming in. Rejects her. Sorry, boo-boo, you gotta go. You gotta go. Happiness is at 16, not that bad. All right. 86,000, casino time, baby. Family, local five and dime family casino. I've lost $65,000. Hopefully that's not going to be added on. Hopefully we can actually start winning. 25,000, let's go. Deal them. It's my lucky day today, hit me. No, <laughs> no. Oh, utter despair. 10,000. Okay, I won. Cool. Let me stop. Argument. Oh, I'm. she's still my girlfriend. Apologize. 35,000. Let me rack up more money. Breakup. This is because I kiss my family on the lips. What? Seriously, it's not from the addiction? Uh, insult her one last time. Assault her. No, I'm going to go to jail. Insult her. Maybe we could sue her. We could sue her for emotional distress. You called her skanky as she was walking out the door. That'll do it, Jamar. That'll do it. Can we sue her now? No. I'd have to sue someone that, like, assaulted me. Like, if she assaulted me? Hmm. Zekia broke up with me. I called her skanky. Hmm. I'm at 54,000. My happiness is pretty low. Why not? Let's just... Only place we know well is the casino. <laughs> Sadly enough. Hit me. Hit me. Stand. Bust, okay. My happiness, I think, went up a little bit. 10,000. Let's do it low increments right now. Hit me. Stand. Great. Let's keep going now that I'm on a roll. Deal him. 17. It's risky to hit me. I'll stand. Awesome. I'm going to roll right now. My happiness is 76%. Holy crap. Keep going at tw I'll 25. I'm starting to get good at this now. Hit me. <gasps> oh my gosh, my luck, you didn't even look. Okay. I'm a gambler, but let me stop. I mean, at least age until next year. Take care of my dog. Give her some love. Gave Luna some cheese. We're so happy, we're up to $109,000. Age. <gasps> Luna! She guzzled bourbon during a party while no one was looking and died from alcohol parsing. Parsing. She died from parsing. What a way to go. Oh, rest in peace, Luna. What a way to go. That's not right. You're, you are no longer suffering from depression. Beautiful. You are no longer suffering from anxiety. Gambling time. Like I said, I would do the horse races, but they're so up to chance. With this one, it's a little bit more strategic. Barrington. Just, I just realized casinos don't matter. It matters. You start to be able to bet more money, depending on how much you win in a row. I've lost 80,000. Okay, let's not make that a thing. $25,000. 
14 hit me. Stand. I lost. Okay, that's enough for me. Uh, I'll go back to 5,000. Just to raise more money. Hit me. Hit me. <laughs> Stand. No. I'm doing shitty. Let me stop. Let me... I know I'm a gambler, but let me stop. Nope. <laughs> nope. Five thousand. Why not? I'm standing. Awesome. Let me see if I could win big in the gambling spirit. Fifty thousand dollars. This is crazy. Standing. Oh my gosh, this is so crazy! Oh wow. Fuck the gym, this is great! <laughs> Just gamble all your money. 50,000. Let me go while I'm on my winning streak. Hit me. I'm still at 13? Bust. Alright. Enough is enough for me. Alright, so I'm not must for high roller must take a lot of money. Dispose of millions. Uh so maybe we could work up to more money. Can I ask I'm going to ask again for a raise. Ask for a raise. I'm rejected. Hmm. Age. Male escort. While out jogging, you encounter a male escort walking down the street. Ignore. I'm not I'm not trying to go to jail. <laughs> I'm not trying to go to jail this time. Hope that I'm gambling enough. Because I'm not gambling every single year. But I'm trying to gamble as much as possible without losing too much money. And I think I'm going to do something else just because I know that the gambling gets a bit old. The activities. Visit a fraternity clinic, mind and body. Nightlife. Let's go clubbing again. Club Omni. Oh, I had fun this time. Someone on the dance floor started arguing with you because you spilled her drink. Argue back. Maybe I could sue her. You argued with her. Ow! <gasps> she sliced your spine! <laughs> haunt this game, rest in peace. I think haunt this game, I'll see if I can get an achievement. I got the mediocre. I got the mediocre one, the mediocre ribbon. That's the easiest ribbon to get. Oh, I didn't even get the addict one. Mm. Jamar Morris, age 30 years old, died August 3rd, 2019. Aw, I wanted, I wanted him to win. I, I wanted him to live, first of all, to get the addict achievement. All right, I got the mediocre achievement. Jamar Morris died at the age of 30. His funeral was attended by three brothers, his niece, LaDonia, and his mother and father. Jamar worked as a construction worker for many years. He once suffered a crippling addiction to gambling. So why didn't I get the attic achievement? You probably have to... Hmm, yeah. You probably have to gamble or you have to be addicted like almost all the time. You have to constantly drink or constantly gamble, I believe, to get that achievement. All right, well, I did get an achievement. I'm going to keep playing. This is this is fun. I'm going to take a quick, quick break first though. So I'll see you guys in a sec. All right, people, I'm back. So let's create, now that Jamar is deceased and haunting the game, let's get, oh, well first, I'm going to check ribbons. We should have the mediocre ribbon. Earned August 3rd. 
Uh, so right now, let's try to get the addict one again. But this time, I want to build a big relationship with my parents. Um, that way, they'll be able to pay for university and study harder so that way I can even get into university. So, custom people. Hmm. Custom. Is this how I do it? First thing, give me all the... I believe so, because last time I did new life. New custom life. Did I... There we go. I hit new random life before. Okay, so first name. Let's name him... L or her. Let's name her Lucky. L Lucky Chavez. Lucky... Lucky... Lucky Slims. No. Lucky... Lucky whatever. Luck let's give her a regular name. Lucky Johnson. Er, female. From Miami. Lucky Johnson from Miami. Born a female in Miami, Florida, United States. I was a planned pregnancy. <laughs> so much more different from Jamar. My birthday is August 12th. I am a Leo. My name is Lucky Johnson. My father is Zion Johnson, a student, 16. <laughs> oh my gosh, they planned this? Okay, never mind. My mother is Pamela Johnson, also 16. This was planned. Please go get help. Um, so let's age. Age until the school age, so I can start studying. What? I've been diagnosed with cancer? I'm sorry? What? I'm going to the doc. Okay, whatever. Dr. Daniela Buck has determined you are currently suffering from cancer of the heart. She's outlined the following treatments. You received treatment from- what? Okay, let's try the other doctor then. No way, this is not going to be a premature death. I'm not ready for it. I'm so young. I'm three. Oh my gosh. Okay, so this might be a quick one. You've been diagnosed with a whooping cough. This poor baby. Please, one of you, help. Well, treat the whooping cough first. Is there any... Is there any other kind of doctor I can go to? Nope. Let's try Daniela Buck again. Please, uh... On. Let's just take. Let's just go to the witch doctor then. I can't go to a witch doctor? Or alternative medicine? I may honestly die early. That's terrible. Jesus. A resource war between Mexico. I don't give a shit. My mother and my father had a baby girl named Anita, my new sister. She was conceived after my father's condom broke. Nice. There's been no duck at no luck at the doctors. Let's age up. Hopefully I don't die in the next year. Your father passed away at 21. Attend. This is poor family. Let's try the doc. One of you one of you can Oh, I- it's 2019. I'm sure one of you could figure out something. Depression. At six. Perfect. Study harder. Uh, activities. I guess let's try to make this life... Let's try to make this life as happy as possible in the short amount of time that we have. Let's hang out with our mom. 
Hmm. Time. You took your mother to watch figure skating. With Anita. No, I can't hang out with Anita. Megan. Oh, they're all littles. What? I guess... Oh, Seamus is our half-brother. I... Who's Megan? They popped... Oh, Megan was... Is that the one where the condom broke? I don't know. Looks, health, happiness. Health is a 3%. <sighs> this, this sucks. Uh, compliment. World class. My happiness is up. I'm sick, study harder. Oh no, I studied already. Get a pet? At least have a furry friend by our side. Gordita, Taffy, Pebbles, but Pebbles is very old. Gordita, Alley Cut. Why not? Okay, my happiness is up. Age. Just ate the food off your plate. I'm, you know what? I'm probably going to die soon. So let's just, re let's just reward her for being a silly kitty. I'm seven. You guys have any luck? Oh my gosh. Study harder. I am like so, I'm so, I'm anxious every time I hit this age button because I'm just my health is at zero percent I'm probably going to die the next time I age up let's see what did I tell you what did I tell you you died from complications associated with cancer of the heart haunt this game I got the un okay so that they mentioned this in the game Zebo website that you would get ribbons inadvertently without even trying. So I got the unlucky ribbon. <clears throat> Tragically, Lucky Johnson lost her long battle with cancer of the heart at the formative age of eight. Her funeral is attended by her siblings and her mother. Friends say the loss of her father at a young age greatly impacted her. Oh, poor Lucky. That, that's actually, now that I'm looking at it, that's kind of funny, but it's not because her name was Lucky and I got the unlucky ribbon. All right. All right, so I'm going to leave this episode here. Uh, it was very unfortunate what happened to Lucky. I really thought I was going to get it this time, and then BitLife just threw a curveball at me, but that's usually how BitLife goes. Uh, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to continue to try to get the Addict achievement. I'll try to do that next episode. Uh, about the High Roller, I'll try, but I highly doubt I'll get it. Usually, the game Zebo also said that you usually get ribbons, one ribbon per life. So, I'm going to aim for the addict achievement or ribbon next episode. Alright, so if you like what you saw, hit that like button and I'll see you real soon. Thanks everybody!